I've got another haul for you. Um, so yeah, on Thursday, after the day was, it was Thursday, I went to Cardiff. Currently Saturday, I'm home alone because my family have gone out. So I got no distractions, it's quiet. Let me just mute my phone so the my notifications don't interrupt me and whatever. So yeah. Okay, I'm gonna go for two things which were from Select, but they weren't from Cardiff, they were from Select in Mesa. But I bought them after I did my Mesa haul. So I'm gonna check them in. This one I've got a notification and I'm just gonna leave it. Okay, they can wait. They can wait. Right, the first thing I bought in Select, which is actually in Mesa, this was £5, was this cute little see through t shirt. Okay, you can't quite see it. Can you see it? No. But it's got it's got metallic blue shine. But for some reason it's not really picking up on the camera. Yeah, it is very, very see-through, but um I would wear this obviously with like a black t-shirt and not really a black t-shirt, but like kind of like a long top. Mm. I wear it with something like I got like this kind of like skin tight black little crop top t-shirt which I wear which I wore last night with it. So yeah. I bought that and yeah that was five pound. Another thing I bought which I can't believe I actually bought something coincidentally matches it yesterday with like this and it's cute it's cute little um, crop top and it's kind of a burgundy type vel it's a velvet burgundy t-shirt and this was five ninety nine. So yeah, those are two things I bought from Mercer. Now onto the stuff I went from Cardiff and I'm gonna show you the thing that matched this t-shirt. And that's this bra. This is slightly lighter. As you can see, it's like. Um, what? Oh. I don't know what you mean. But like, it's very. It's like a very similar colour. You know? And it's actually the same texture and everything. So I'm like, okay, that's a coincidental match. But then I didn't really actually realise until I got home. And this literally was a pound. I shit you not. One pound for a bra, loving it. And I love Prima bras. I love them. I've got quite a few of them. And they've, la they've lasted me for quite a while so far. And so yeah, I bought this one, which I really love. It's cute. And then another bra I bought was this red um, lace one. So it's gonna make it. It's got like, a clasp in the front, which I think more bras should have a clasp in the front. Honestly, because I don't actually take my bras off, but like with the clasp, I take off like a t-shirt. I just took it off my head because I'm too lazy to unclasp. But I'm like, I got bitch. I don't care. I can't be asked over like a t-shirt by your hand. But yeah, it's like a cute little, little red lace detailing around the top here. Oh, this is just like a normal soft material. And then on the back, it's got this cute little lace detailing. As you can see, I need that from that view. So yeah, quite nice. And um, this was two pound fifty. So two pound fifty for another uh, lace bra. I love the bras in Primark. I swear they are definitely worth checking out and having a look around because the prices of them are like so good for the quality as well. Like I love them. And then moving on. I also bought some socks. Where's the other one? Where's the other one? Over there. I got it. Um, I bought two um lace, like fishnet, not lace, fishnet socks. One's a red one, one's a khaki one. There is a lot of red and khaki in within this haul. I'm going to point that out now. So yeah, these were 50p each. I'm going to cough. <coughs> 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 Next thing I bought was this khaki t-shirt. This was in the women's section. And this was £2. Was it £2? Were you £2? I don't remember. I believe you were. I put the receipt away. But yeah, that was £2, I believe. So, I really like that. So yeah, I got that. This one does not have a tag on it or anything, so I can't even tell them. And then this was from the men's section, because I don't care. Uh, and this is the, and, uh, just a plain red t-shirt. Um, so yeah, and this, it does say £2 on it. But when I went, they had like an offer on them. And 
it was actually one pound eighty. So there's that. And this is the extra small men's one. It fits me like my Justin mood, so it's still a little bit long, but it's not like stupid long. You know, it's a comfy long. I like to call it a comfy long. Next thing I bought was this cute little black crop top. It has like a kind of like a scrunching. Oh my god, you can't see because my quality is cropping my camera in this type of lighting. Because it's not natural. If I'm not in natural lighting, I feel like the quality of my camera because I'm only using my iPod. Um, it isn't the best, but like in normal lighting, like actual natural lighting, it is a lot better, but like, you can see like, how grainy it looks when it was this, but yeah, you can't quite see it when from far away, sorry about that, I don't have a tidy camera, but yeah, it's got like a kind of like scrunchy in the middle of there, and this was £4, I believe, where's the tag gone? Um, honey, where are you? Oh, there you are. Yes, it was four pound. My dog is trying to get the stairs, but because we've had a new flooring out the hallway, she can't. Because she can't walk on it, and it's kind of funny. We just hear her claws skidding across. <laughs> um, next thing I bought with these shorts is a cute little pajama clothes. My friend picked these up, but she picked up the long pajama shorts, but I don't like long pajama shorts because of the amount of sweat I produce in my sleep. This is a disgusting fact, you didn't need to know about me, but there we go. So I do buy a lot of pajama shorts because not as warm. So yeah, I might go back another time and buy one of the other men's t-shirts in like this kind of bluey grey colour to match with these. So yeah, and these, oh wait, how much are these? These are £2.50. So there's that, and then and I also bought this as well, which I thought it was a cute little hat. It's just a little cap that says "hand on it." It's kind of like a greyish colour. It's kind of got a nice soft. I don't know what material it is. I when I don't know. Does it say on here? No, it doesn't say. What type of? No, it doesn't say the material or anything. Does it say in here? One side, one No. No, it says nothing about the material. Um, I'm pretty sure it should say the material in here. Oh, yes, it does. I have no idea, but there we go. Um, I studied DMT, by the way. I studied sewing. I studied materials. I don't know shit. I didn't pass it, but I studied it. And the last two things I got from Primark were these two face masks. One is a charcoal peel off one and the other one is just a bubble mask. And these were 80p each. Oh, the hat was £4, by the way. Um, but yeah, that's everything I got in Primark. Moving on to Superdrug, I got these two things from um, MUA. Well, both of my eyeliners, I got this khaki green one and just this plain white one. And these were a pound each. So I got them. Um, from NYX, which I went to Boots, and from NYX, I got the NYX Liquid Suede Cream Lipstick. I can't be asked to move any more forward than this. <laughs> uh -huh. But yeah, uh, I got that, and this is in the shade Alien, which is basically black. My dog just walked into my room and I was sniffing. You okay, Glow? Mm. What do you want? What? What is it? No, don't eat my rainbow drops. Thank you. Okay, moving on. And the last thing I bought was from H&M. No, it's not Bieber merch. I got shouted at from my mum not to buy it. I'm banned from buying Justin merch again. Uh, uh, I cry. No, these are actually from Nicki, Minaj, Nicki Minaj's range, so, and these are, um, this cute, uh, the lip, the, the, the liquid lip, it's not liquid lipstick, is it? Liquid suede, was well, £7. Um, but yeah, this was a pound, and it's this is cute little, um, bracelet, but it's like, uh, kind of like a collar thing to it, which I kind of like, and that was a pound. I also bought the matching choker, which I think is really, really cute. So yeah, that's, and that was £2. And that is everything I bought. 
So, yeah. Another successful uh, trip, I believe. I literally went to get summer stuff because I'm going away today. And I wanted to go to get summer stuff. Did I get summer stuff? No. I did buy pyjama shorts, which I could use to go away. Um, I did buy a sun hat. I did buy like, some summery stuff. But it's like, I was looking for shorts and white jeans. I did have white jeans, but wasn't risking it. No, no. No, no. Wasn't risking it. And I'm going to leave it as that, as you could probably guess why. But yeah, um, because it's in season, they haven't quite got the summer stuff in yet. So I think I'm going to go again in Easter, but I think I'm going to Swansea next because I'm not Cardiff. Because I do prefer the Primark in Swansea rather than the one in Cardiff. I don't know, I just prefer it better. I prefer the setup, I prefer the layout of the Swansea one. I find the card fun so dark because a lot of it is just black. Like, the lightings are really dim and it's like... I prefer the old... And it's like, obviously they've redone it, like quite a few years back it's like kind of all dark i don't like it because i'm like i can't really see the clothes like properly and like, the swansea one is still got the old design with the white and the teal as the uh, new one's black and teal but i'm like no i like and they got brighter lights i feel so i'm like i need to see and i need to see the fucking clothes so yeah that's everything i bought bye guys